Whoa, you have a chunk of uranium-235. What should you do with it? You should probably uh, not touch it or anything like that. Uh, <laughs> uh, th thank you for the chat. Um, uh, if you have a lead-lined box, that would probably be the best place to put the uranium. Uh, I don't know for sure if 235 is the one that's the most radioactive or not. Uh, I'd have to look it up. But yeah, put it in a lead-lined box and probably call the government. That'd probably be your best way to do that. <laughs> oh! Uranium-235 is the one that makes the bombs? Okay, yeah. D definitely uh, put it in a lead-lined box and call the government. Uh, I've seen people make uh, uranium glass and stuff online and uranium glass is supposed to be uh, good as long as you do not eat off it <laughs> and it also glows in the dark so i mean probably don't use uranium 235 for that but it's a cool thing to look at also i took a bite out of it before i knew what it was Ooh, ooh. <laughs> I know you're joking, but oh gosh, that would be terrible. Hey, at least you won't have to eat anything more. I mean, uh, uranium's got a lot of calories in it, okay? So you probably don't have to eat anything else for the rest of your life. I, I can bet on that. <laughs> oh, you haven't eaten in two weeks. Oh, that. hey, there you go. If you're still alive after two weeks and eating uranium-235, I think you are safe. <laughs> Somehow. I don't see how you're doing fine, but I I'd say you're good. Wait a second, are you like a Godzilla kind of thing? Because doesn't Godzilla like eat radioactive things to power himself? Gosh. Ooh, your fingers grow in the dark. That's pretty cool. Like how much glow? Like do like is it enough that you can hold out your hand in front of you and see? Because that'd be pretty cool. No flashlights, man. Not a flashlight, but it's like the little glow in the dark stars people have put... Oh my gosh, it's funny you mentioned that. I have some of those stars on my ceiling right now. They're not I didn't put them there, but this is my sister's old room. So there are still some of those stars that are on my ceiling. So I know exactly what you're meaning there, okay? But like that's still kind of cool. I mean, it won't be very good if you're trying to sneak around. If you're trying to sneak around at night, uh, of course, glowing in the dark like hands would not be great. You'll have to wear some like really black gloves that will kind of hold in your radioactive powers. Ooh, actually, ooh, tell me if you get any superpowers because superpowers are pretty good and that's what you think of people like around radio radiation. So I guess you're kind of like the glowing baby from My Hero Academia. <laughs> oh, you uh, pee orange, that's my superpower. Like, are you talking about like a uh, like, uh, Fanta orange, like a uh, nice, like orange orange or are you talking like uh diluted orange juice orange because if you don't pee for very long it's like that of course your pee is going to be a little bit red or orange but if you're like fanta orange that is that's a little um disturbing i'll say that oh you just peed it's yellow hey see that's normal right as long as it's like a normal yellow and not like I don't know. Uh, banana yellow. How, like, if it's not a banana peel yellow, I mean, that's... <laughs> or highlighter yellow. Highlighter yellow would be bad, okay? 